So this is Gamera, the mud turtle. I've had Gamera for about six years. Got him off Craigslist. Woman was selling him as a box turtle. She bought him from a pet store as a box turtle and was keeping him like a box turtle, which means a um, terrestrial habitat. And he would only eat out of his water dish, which was like a, one of those little Chinese food containers. So I guess she figured she was doing something wrong with him. Didn't know how to take care of him and was getting rid of him. Wise decision. Because as you can see, mud turtles are not terrestrial. They are aquatic. So I've had him for about six years now. Don't know how old he is. If you're wondering where he gets his name from, <clears throat> Gamera is a giant turtle from Japan who uh, is a friend to all children, very large, shoots fire from his mouth, and flies around with jetpacks coming out of his shell. This Gamera does none of those things, but he's pretty cool anyway. So he's about, he's a little turtle, he's about four or five inches. And uh, that's what I really like about these mud turtles. Is a, they're much more manageable in size than even something like a ready slider. I wish we'd see more of them sold instead of the sliders, but you know, it is what it is. He's in a 55 gallon tank. Uh, the filter is over there under those rocks. It's a fluval. I don't know which model number it is, but it's rated for 40 gallons. He's probably got about 40 gallons in here. <clears throat> Maybe a little less. Now, uh, as for his confusion as a box turtle, I'll show you where that comes from. Alright, so if you take a look at Gamera here, he's, uh, he's a little camera shy. He's not only going to go in his shell, but he's going to close it. See? It's like a box turtle. He's got a hinged shell. Aside from that, I mean, there's no similarity between him and a, uh, and a box turtle. But you can, you can see how somebody might get confused if they didn't know they're turtles. Now it might be a little while before he comes back out of there. I guess there's not much else to say about him. Uh, this this green stuff growing on his platform, I believe, is Java moss because they used to have a lot of it in here, but it would clog up the filter. So I threw it all away. But it looks like some of it had taken hold on his platform. I kind of like how it looks; it looks natural. What I don't like is these the the mats of um, blue green algae that are growing everywhere on every surface in here but uh... you know i guess that's more just an aesthetic problem and not an actual issue of concern if you do have any questions feel free to ask in the comment section make sure you like and subscribe and uh... we'll switch over to the gopro and see if maybe he wants to eat a uh... eat some fish so that should be pretty cool